Hello everyone, I am Dr. Moina Kroy. I have secured an anchor uh, 296 in the UR category uh, in July 2021 INICT exam. We will like to keep this as simple and short as possible. Uh, first of all, I want to give a big thank you to uh, Dr. Sumesh Sethi sir for giving me this opportunity of speaking about my prep strategy in front of you guys on a bigger platform. Uh, first of all, I want to say that uh, DAMS has a plethora of courses to op offer, whether you are an intern, post-intern, MB student, DAMS has it all covered. You don't have to worry about the uh, preparation schedule and all, DAMS uh, faculties are very experienced in this matter. They plan the uh, duration of study, courses, test, everything, so that you, your syllabus gets completed in time, as well as you get time for multiple revisions. DAMS notes are very crisp to the point not filled with unnecessary data just the amount of data you require to clear an entrance exam and this becomes very helpful in the uh, uh, last phase of the journey where you need to do multiple quick revisions so a small set of notes crisp set of notes is very helpful for that DAMS faculties are very approachable whether in offline class or on social media. No doubts with even if it's very trivial is not ignored by the DAMS faculties. And uh, next I want to share some quick uh, preparation strategy with you guys. Uh, first of all, make a realistic timetable and stick to that. Start aggressively because towards the end most of the people burn out revising the same old stuff every day so i would suggest whether you, when you are full of energy in the beginning start from that time onwards aggressively try to complete as much as possible no one completes the entire syllabus it's means it's vast very vast it, infinite like so no one really completes the entire stuff even if you remember 70 to 80 percent of what you did that will be sufficient to clear the exams uh, next i want to say that trust one set of notes revise it more and more don't run after uh, rare uh, updates like those just comprise hardly five percent of the question the main bulk of the question lies from the uh, what you have read try to read it over and over again multiple revisions are the key and uh, try to memorize them uh, and about bookmarked questions in QBank, uh, that's not mandatory for you to go through the bookmarked questions over and over again. The yearly questions are must because both in NEET as well as uh, all the central institute exams, yearly question tends to be repeated. If not directly, the topics are asked every time and uh, GT reviews, uh, I would say even if you don't review the full GT, you must review the guess marked questions and the uh, questions that went wrong. These are a must and uh, last but not the least, many uh, interviews don't focus on this topic which is your mental health. First remember your health is must, then exams and all everything comes. So if you feel boredom, if you feel anxious and all, if you think you cannot continue, stop, take rest, talk to your family members and all and uh, then continue and if you feel that uh, all these strategies are not helping you at all then you can consult a experienced psychiatrist in this matter and uh, lastly i want to wish you all the best uh, don't rule yourself out as uh, dr sumit sethi said always says uh, i myself have uh, means was not at all expecting a rank of 296 uh, this time I was a pretty average student in my college days. Uh, uh, I got around two to three honors sub honors in those 19 subjects, which is not a very big deal. So just keep faith in yourself. My, uh, revise your notes multiple times. Keep GTs. Talk to your teachers whenever you feel any problem or doubt regarding subjects or anything. And I am sure you will do uh, your best. Thank you. It has been a very good time talking to you all. Bye.